Gil and Laura back at the Track Shack with all this week's big buzz. Jenny McCarthy, <gasps> former Playboy Playmate, mm -hmm. star of Two and a Half Men. Yeah, sometimes. Huddy. Very hot. Extraordinaire. Hot. Is dating a guy from Boston. I love this. Now, she, of course, dated Jim Carrey for five years. Five years. And that must have been a real laugh riot, I'm Oh, thinking. yeah. <laughs> Kicks <laughs> him to the curb. She said that after that, she had completely given up on L.A. guys. Because they had more concealer and makeup than she did. Right, so she's basically begging all her friends and family, fix me up, I, I'm lame, I can't find I my can't own find guys, guy. you know. So she said she went out on a series of horrible dates where guys were asking her like, do you know Sharon Stone? Can you get me your autograph? Which, you know, yeah, really, probably didn't it. go over too big. And her sister, who's married to a former professional hockey player, mm -hmm. fixes her up with this guy from Boston who's a sports agent in Bobby Orr's, you know, management group. Right. And she's madly in love. He's still a Boston guy, he's still a local guy, and Jenny says that his accent is so goodwill hunting that she doesn't always understand him and that they may in fact be engaged and she would have no idea. He may have proposed, she may have said yes, she didn't understand a word of it. Jenny also told Ellen DeGeneres this week that Evan, her, her son. son, her eight-year-old son, has not met Paul. No. Because he is on a very strict six-month kind of meet and greet kind mm -hmm. of thing. Yeah, where... she's got to be with the guy for six months before right. she introduces him to the kid. Because Which is good I think that's I think. a good thing. I agree. I think that's very you know, good. Like a revolving door of guys marching through the house. Like, for instance, oh, Kate Hudson. Oh, really? Yeah. Pregnant? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Her boyfriend, Muse frontman Matt Bellamy, and she are having a baby. Well, at least it wasn't A-Rod. We can be Thank thankful for these God. small favors. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much. Yeah, now, she had a series of actor boyfriends. Mm -hmm. There was Owen Wilson, Dak Shepard. I mean, there were... And a series of musician yes. husbands slash boyfriends. Right. You, you know, know Chris Robinson job, from obviously. The Black Rose. Father of her first child. Right, the one with the long hair. Mm -hmm. Ryder. Yes. Ryder, yeah. And now she's with child again. Yes. Any marriage plans? Uh, they didn't say. They okay. have not said. No. Well, like I said, at least a wedding. You know who does have wedding plans? Yes, I do. Rick Tell Fox. Me. And Eliza Dushko. Yes. Home couple. He used to be a Celtic. Mm -hmm. He was a Laker too, but we like to forget mm. about that. And she's from Watertown, and they've right. been dating for, you know, about a year or so. Yeah. And very happy, and uh, he hears wedding bells. Now, before he actually proposes to Eliza, mm -hmm. I propose that he become a better husband. Kind of get that whole husband thing down. Okay. Because you know, when he was with Vanessa Williams. Cheated. Okay. <laughs> you really gotta not do that. You really can't. No. No. It doesn't go over well with the wife. No. Usually. And you know, knowing Eliza, she's not gonna take that. Oh, no. No, no. Why should she? Watertown. <laughs>